In this video, I'll demonstrate how to create a rotating wheel and a sliding text effect using the PowerPoint Morph transition. So, let's get started and dive right in. First, let's insert a picture from the stock image as our primary background. Then let's cut the picture using your keyboard. Press Ctrl plus X to use it as a clipboard. Next, right-click and select Format Background. Choose Texture Fill and select Clipboard. Then, insert a rectangle shape as our shadow fill and select the Format Shape. Choose Gradient Fill and adjust the center gradient. Let's set the left corner fully transparent. Then set the gradient into Portrait. and change the right color to black to be our shadow. And set the corner line as no line. Then, as our rotating wheel, we will insert a summing junction and select the format shape. Make this our slide background fill. With white and a solid line of 1.5. Set the presets shadow going right side and adjust the size to 102%. Next, let's insert a text for our rotating wheel and put it in the four corners.
let's put another circle shape and put it on the center of the summing junction. As with the previous setting, let's set this as our slide background fill with a white solid line. Adjust the presets to the right with a size of 102%. Now, to rotate the wheel, press the cocktail key and highlight all the shapes, including the text, excluding the center circle, and press the Ctrl plus G key to make this as a group. Let's insert a text to make our presentation engaging. Next, duplicate the slide one as our next page. Then change the background. Then, here's the trick. Rotate the big circle 60 degrees counterclockwise. And rotate the center circle to 180 degrees clockwise. Then, adjust the text space on the picture. Next, duplicate again the slide 2 and repeat the step we made on the second slide. Once we complete, select all the slides and select the Morph Transition. For more Pinoy trick tips, please like and subscribe.